Hello everyone, 8 o'clock on Ironman Eve, the eve of the Ironman World Championships in Kailua Kona, Hawaii. Again, doesn't that just roll off the tongue? Right, tomorrow at 7 a.m. I am going to be I am going to be doing a catered training day. That is my new word for Ironman. A long training day with all your food and drink chucked in. Wonderful. That is where I'm going to play it. Uh, at this point in time, I'm confident. Uh, but that normally changes in the night when I go to sleep and I wake up sweating. Hey, that's, that's all part of the rich tapestry of life. Big thanks to my support crew for getting here because getting to the start line in any Ironman is an achievement in itself. I've always said that. So what am I going to do tomorrow in my catered training day? Instead of channeling all my training for this race into that day tomorrow, I'm going to channel, or try to, channel 25 years of my triathlon experience into one day. And I'm going to try and be average at all three in an attempt to finish and win. I've said that to many people in the past, the average are all three, and I might stand by it. It's been reminded to me this week in uh, a lovely message, and uh, it certainly struck me right between the eyes. I've mentioned in a number of these blogs about the inspirational messages support um, on Facebook, text and email. I've got to read a couple of these out to you. Whew. Here we go. Running down that finish line with 100 metres to go, I want tears from you. Tears for all the sacrifices you have made. Tears for your family and mates. And most importantly, tears for Catherine. When your tears hit the floor, they will burn a stain forever. Another one. All of us who know what it means are so envious and proud that we know you. Another. I listen to every word you, you, you tell me as I trust and love you. You inspire me and definitely a part of the way that I am. How can one not be inspired with, with words like that? And they're just a selection of many, many emails, texts, and messages on Facebook. So how can I repay that? I can repay that quite easily by delivering for you the finish tomorrow. That is the best way I can repay you. I can't think of words, I can't think of any words that I can use right now to answer those back. And those words are for champions, not average, Middle of, the, middle of the road athletes. I've heard those words written about champions. But moving on, certain people inspire me. Lots of people, lots of things inspire me. For example, I'm not in any order. My swim group, what a great bunch. Southwest Please Try team. I have to mention Maxi, Evzy, Lottie, my big mate Dino. You know, the backbone of the club. In my Lanzarote days, there was, there is rather, many people there who, who have supported me through thick and thin. Graham, Sarah, the lovely Margaret who's no longer with us. Who's no longer with us. Graham, I, I have to mention, I think of it all the time at times like this. You know what I'm talking about. Richard and Emma from Wakefield and their families true stalwarts of, of support in me. And my good friend Liz Owen from Cardiff, she knows exactly what this means to me. You all do. So there we go. That's where I am now. Seven o'clock tomorrow morning, I'll be on that start line. And those are the things that I'll be thinking of throughout the day. Hopefully you will be updated by 
a number of blogs by uh, by my son Ross, and that's about as much as I can say for right now. Thank you very much. I love you guys, and the next time you hear from me is post catered training day. Kev Pollen signing off.